Hello YouTube. This is an, a, a tutorial on how to make a paperweight with anything you have to hand. Uh, sufficient, but not adequate. A heart you can get from the butcher. Actually, great to hold. A USB microscope as a paperweight. It's a little unwieldy. The mechanism for your pet bot. <laughs> Not a great paperweight. Anything you have for taking your apartment off grid would probably make a very good paperweight. A hula hoop filled with New England wildflower seeds that you can use to spread flowers. Taking cola nut extract from West Africa so that the forests don't get deforested, then actually using it as a paperweight makes it a little bit more visually tantalizing to uh, look through it to your bills. If you happen to have a magazine cover with yourself on it, that's going to make a really good paperweight. You don't really want to look at it. Vacuum pressure holds in the water, the air pushes up, this pushes down so it floats. I think this is the best paperweight. Physically dominated, presses and contains those threatening papers. This is a printer that uses edible inks and edible paper. This is one of Phil Ross's um, mycelium building units. This is biochar. It's a little bit dirty. It's this char that you work into the soil and it sequesters carbon for you know some 5,000 years, maybe a million. Who's counting, right? At that point, you know, if you sequester carbon with a forest, it's a couple of hundred years. But here is biochar that points to the future of local power production, where we take our paper waste, we incinerate it um, to produce both energy, soil augmenting. Um, it increases the productivity of the soil, creates these luxury housing apartments for, for soil microbes that then release nutrients to plants and immobilizes heavy metals and breaks down um, nasty industrial contaminants. And you take your paper to produce all these things. To use this as a paperweight seems to be, um, I think this is, this is the most hopeful, if the dirtiest. I think biochar, in the end, points us to a, an interesting future with our papers. Goodbye, YouTube. Hello, biochar.